Joining us here in the Thompson Broadcast Gates Air Booth, Mark Simpson with Trevenny Digital. And there are so many exciting things going on at NAB this year, aren't there? True, true statement. I think that's true every year. I think this year is a little different in some sense. I view it as a really kind of like a transition year between phases of APSC tree rollout. I mentioned APSC tree, of course, because that's really one of the main things Triveni has been focused on for years. Uh, we led the standard development process, in fact. Um, you know, so we're very much dedicated to APSC tree trying to make it happen. We see a lot of progress. And then now it's like, where do we go next? I think a lot of the commercial broadcasters are kind of struggling to find frequency. The next one, it was encouraging to hear the, um, the sort of F FCC and NAB announcement that a task force will be put together. Uh, so that's encouraging if that's needed. We see a lot of sort of innovative concepts being uh, shown this year. Actually, uh, Trivedi with our partners, um, Device Solutions and uh, PDS North Carolina, won the NAB Innovation Award. So we're very proud of that. There's one a year given, we won that. What that's about is using EPS, oh, thank you. It's about using EPSC free to implement what really is a, in a way, a paging network for a replacement for their old paging network for first responders. So it used to be uh, some sort of emergency, a fireman would get a little, you know, text-based page. Now that can be done over the EPSC free airwaves which has a lot of advantages. The reach is better, the robustness of the reception, et cetera. A lot of key advantages for this. Nice to be recognized. I think that could be very useful for a lot of the public broadcasters throughout the country, you know, if their state agencies would want to consider such a system. So that's just an example. A lot of interesting things here. Absolutely. And your partnership with Thompson Broadcast continues, particularly on that Next Gen TV knock, which we... Yes. We have up in, in the Thompson Broadcast Gates Air booth, and that, tell me a little bit about that project. Well, I guess I'll start by saying what I think is the importance of it, right? Because we're mentioning all these interesting things, many of which will actually become, you know, revenue-bearing concepts, which means that the service uh, profile, if you will, of the broadcast you know, is much more complex than ever as we succeed with HSC3. So the question of how you manage that and keep that on robustly is really, really important. To be honest, some of the earlier stuff so far really maybe is not quite as fully fleshed out or robust. So like, how about the redundancy architecture? You know, how about the reach over the mountain? You know, so one of the things we've got in our booth is a AKSC tree translator that will allow your signal to be received on top of the mountain in, in one use case and then rebroadcast down to the valley. Those kinds of things existed and are widely distributed in APSC-1. Now we're starting to flesh it out in APSC tree. So back to your question, the services coming are much more complex than before. How do you manage that? You don't, you can't possibly have somebody sitting there turning knobs, right? So it's really a fairly complex thing to tie together all the elements of a distribution system potentially a nationwide distribution system. And so this media knot we're working on with Thompson, you know, tries to tackle that. Now our role we have in our StreamScope platform, really the industry's most advanced APSC3 test and measurement platform. I mean, it has an analyzer product, it has a monitor product, and it also has an enterprise and management product. That's the thing that is tying our sort of eyes and ears, if you will, of the monitoring into some of the knock um, suffer from, from labbing from Thompson. And I think the combination is really needed to have a, a, we have a fully automated uh, platform for basically, you know, what, what does this kind of thing do? If, if, she, if it detects errors, it helps isolate those errors and it helps solve the errors. You know, the main the sort of actionable platform to keep these things running. So it's really a solutions-based platform yeah. for other companies who are, are looking to implement that next-gen TV. Yeah, I think it's really aimed at the media companies that are, in some cases, going to have, you know, content distribution over multiple broadcast towers. And then, you know, as we look at data distribution um, businesses, so let's say the automotive space, they're talking about that being nationwide to a fleet of cars, the you know, people drive rapid. How do you keep that running? Right, I mean, that's complex. So a lot of those will be implemented with knocks that 
have uh, I I call it eyes and ears, kind of like eyes and ears on a nationwide basis. So some of the larger broadcasters should be quite interested in this kind of technology is needed uh, for them to you know deploy all these services. And partnerships are key, right? Yeah, I try many and and Thompson have partnered for many years yeah. and and really brought a lot of innovation to market. True. And now that Gates Air is part of the Thompson family, I mean, we'd go back with Gates Air to probably the year 2000, which is when we first started trying to sell a product as Triveni. We were founded in 1997, but 2000, we started trying to sell. Um, so our partnerships with the Thompson family are deep and historic. Um, but the point about partnership is a very important one. Ecosystem is critical to make all this work. No one company has everything. And so the ecosystem, what I mean by that is selecting, you know, some of the best of lead technologies and working with them to integrate your technologies so that there's a, you know, a, a platform that involves all of it. That's necessary for things like the media knock. Um, you know, there's these orchestration software layers that are emerging. HPE has one, Cast Out of ERA has one. We're extremely well integrated with both. So the partnering is critical because the ecosystem is, you know, so we're, that's one thing we're proud of as Trivedi. We're very good at that. My development team, talk to anyone who works with us. I've never heard anyone not tell me that we're the, the best. Like they always say, we're, the, we're great to work with. My team has tremendous expertise and are, are good people. So we like the partnerships. Works well with others. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> what I, mean, I don't, but my people do. <laughs> no, yeah. no, I know you do. Thank you so much, and we appreciate you coming back to share your vision and your experience with us. Great. Thanks for the chance to talk about it. Take care.